Okay, so I've shown you a lot of music programs, uh, things like Ardor and Hydrogen, and I usually suggest connecting them all through JackD. Uh, some of them require you to use JackD, and uh, it's kind of like a soundboard that allows you to uh, record from one to another program, but it also helps you synchronize the programs. Now you notice if I press play on Hydrogen here, Hydrogen will play, but, and if I press play on Ardor, Ardor will play. I don't have any audio track in there right now. Uh, same with uh, recording in Ardor. That's because we're using the internal timer on Ardor. By default, Hydrogen and some other programs will use the Jack D timer. But we've come over here where it says uh, uh, internal on uh, Ardor. We can click on that and we can go down to Jack. And now if I press play in Ardor, it also starts up Hydrogen. Uh, or any program that is linked with Jack D to use for timing. This allows it uh, to, for you to very easy if you have the uh, same um, uh, tempo, which both are set to a 120 right now, I believe. Let me maximize this, have a look. Oh no, I'm going to set this to 120 as well. And now I can press record here, and when I press play, it will play hydrogen and it will record right in time in Ardor. And I can hit stop and it stops both of them. And if you look here, you can see the beat is just online with the tempo properly, so you don't have to align it later. This is very convenient when you're trying to uh, get a drum beat going in one machine, uh, one uh, program, and record to another, and then uh, you can also have a uh, you know a drum machine and a beat machine and diff just different applications going, and easily sync them all like that. So once again, in our door to allow it, uh, you click by default. This says internal. Click jack, and then anytime you press play or stop or forward or back, it does the same in hydrogen. Uh, another program that uses it, Jack D uh, for timing by default uh, is Jack Beat, and uh, I'm sure there's others, but you know, just wanted to give you a quick look at how to do that with Ardor and Hydrogen. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial, I hope you found it useful, and I hope you visit filmsbychris.com for more video tutorials like this. Have a great day.